Well, um, today we uh, grieve with the families uh, of the PS Flight 752. Uh, they lost loved ones, mothers, fathers, sisters, brothers, wives, husbands, sons and daughters. And uh, first and foremost, our hearts are with the, the survivors today who remember their lost loved ones. Secondly, we have to redouble our commitment to uh, impose consequences on the regime and to prosecute those who carried out this terrorist attack. That means pushing harder at the International Criminal Court and the International Court of Justice. It also means criminalizing the IRGC as a terrorist organization so that its agents can no longer operate freely, raise funds, coordinate and recruit here in Canada. And uh, finally, Conservatives want law enforcement to investigate members of the regime and the IRGC who are operating freely in Canada with the stolen plunder of the people of Iran uh, who are intimidating members of the diaspora community uh, and interfering in our politics. All of that must, ha must end and that will mean where possible prosecuting and expelling members of the regime and the IRGC who are operating here. What can Iranian community expect uh, Mr. Justin to, to do more, to act more? Well, he has the power to, he, 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 the Prime Minister has the power to criminalize the IRGC today. He has that power in law, it's just a decision he has to make. And uh, we call on him to make that decision now.